In Word 2013, it's now possible to open and edit documents in the popular PDF format. This feature, known as PDF Reflow, can open any PDF file, but it works best with files which contain mostly text or tables, for example, this printer parts list. When a PDF file is opened, Word will convert the contents into an editable version that can be saved as a Word document or back to PDF. So let's give it a try. First, I'll locate the PDF file I want to edit. I'll click the File tab, then Computer, and jump to My Documents, where the original printer parts list is found. When the PDF file is opened, Word notifies me that the file will be converted into an editable Word document, which may not display exactly like the original, especially if it contains graphics. So I'll click OK, and in this example, it looks like it has converted the PDF nicely. Now I can make some changes, like adjusting the heading. I need to add another row here, and I notice that after clicking, Word has identified the area as a table and made table tools available on the ribbon. That's perfect, and means from the design tab, I can add a little style while I'm here. Speaking of tables, it's a bit easier to add a row exactly where you want. Place the mouse to the left and just above where you want the row to be added and click the plus sign. I'll add the new printer information, and I'm done. Then back to the file tab and save. By default, the updated file will be saved as a Word document, which is ideal for future editing. But you also have an option to save it back to PDF directly from Word. In the Save As Type list, choose PDF, change the file name if needed, and if the Open File After Publishing box is checked, the PDF version of the document will open after clicking Save.